Good evening everybody, welcome back to Someday. Someday. This will be our, our second little adventure into the world of Someday with young Itsuki. I had to turn the volume down a little bit because uh, I got my headset replaced after it was broken. And when I reinstalled it, um, this game got really loud, which gave me a fright. Especially seeing as it's, it's quite late in the day. Yeah, it's still raining outside. That's good. Uh, well, that means we can go back into a dream. Now, um, the creator of this game, Jojo Gape, has actually uh, commented on the previous video, which is cool. So hopefully if he has any further comments, insights, he wants to shout at me, he can go ahead. I'll be right here for it. So we're going to go in here based on a suggestion and um, see what's going on. We've got Cheerios. That's good. Part of a healthy, balanced breakfast. And we're going to go down here on this little green pathway. Oh. Ooh, now, do, 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 do. no, no, that's not that kind of scare. Yes, here we go. Yes, welcome to dreaming on uh, high life, high life dreaming, where you can speed around at the speed of speed, drive down all the little yellow pencils. It's not really a pen. What kind of crazy pencil would be like this? I hope this is going to be too maze-like. One thing I want to try and do, I, I, all these little first like views of things uh, as a peanut um, end up being super long. Spaghetti. Don't have spaghetti for breakfast. Or onion rings, for that matter. Oh, jeez. I didn't even think of that because of the book. You have cubes. Cubes are fine. Um, these videos end up being stupidly long. That, the, the first video I did of this was, um, it was over half an hour long. Uh, we must have gone around in a circle. More spaghetti. Onion rings. Pyramid. Okay, cool. Oh, yeah. Okay, we can't go that way. Okay. I like this. Let's get to the rave, come on. Who says fabric needs to close? That was sudden. Oops, oops. Yes. You need to go and, uh, referring to the guy who made this, you need to go and do some music for the, the Project Yumutsuki because it's much more like it. Oh, then again, I think if you had a whole game like this, you'd probably... Uh, you wouldn't be able to stop raving. Let's see, can we interact with this in some manner? That's a proper rave attire there. In a diving suit. Is it, like, is there an unwritten rule that your, your fan game has to have, like... Someone with, like, high... Octane music and little flashing tiles that make different sounds when you walk on them. I mean, I've seen a few of these, and this is pretty, pretty soft core as far as they go. I mean, there's no. See, that's quite cool, actually. I like that. That's like, I like that. I like that. I'm not so sure about that, but okay. What, if anything, are we looking for in this? Crazy old mix mishmash of thingums. We're going to use the traditional um, scientific method of just driving around until we find whatever we're supposed to be finding. It's not let me down yet, has it, guys? It's not, say, taking a game which probably has about 20 hours worth of gameplay and spread it over like a hundred episodes, has it? No, of course it hasn't. It should be a little less. Uh, there should be, I should say, a little bit more echoey in this episode because um, my room is back to normal. The thing about having. Yeah, that's where we came in, isn't it? Yeah. The thing about. I, I had a, a mattress lying on the floor in my living room for a while. And as annoying as that was, it absorbed noise, which meant there was less of an echo when it was recording things. Hmm. 
Hmm. It feels like that's significant somehow. Maybe we need a certain effect or something to to trigger it. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I'm uh, I'm not immediately getting the gimmick. Oh, hey, what are you? Megaphone. Press one to make a random sound. Don't mind if I do. Random sounds. That's practically what my let's plays are. Random sounds. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> the car. Uh, <laughs> uh, that's brilliant. That's brilliant. Love it. I don't, I, I don't know. I got mad. Right, it's, uh, can we. Maybe. Let some. Um, Nah, that was never going to work, was it? Let's see if we can get out of here, because this is all good, but it's also very loud, and I could do with a break from this, if only for a moment. I just need to find our way out. That's fine, because we made use of all the different landmarks, and we, we know the way out. We did, just watch. It's just, um, it's just over here. Just, just, I know it is. No, no, not that, not that. Scooters are quite cool. I, well, I say scooters are quite cool. I see people commuting in London on scooters. Maybe it isn't that cool. Because usually it's like, you know, not old folk, but grown ups. Not, not. Youngins, because you know that's not cool anymore. All right, okay, okay, come on, come on now. Let's 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 ease off a bit. Let's come down off this uh, trip. Now, now, come on. All right, you know what? Let's um, let's just do that. That'll be quicker. What the light's at? What? Who's in charge of that? Oh, we can't use the computer. What now? Um. Hmm. Someone get to the generator. We gotta, we gotta kickstart it. What do you do when your power goes off? Uh, light some candles and then cry. Okay, let's just go back to bed. Let's just go back to bed. It's fine. That's another thing you can do. Assuming say it's not the middle of winter and you freeze to death. That would be mighty unfortunate. It could happen. I know that certainly back where. I hail from, you had problems like that, if the power went off, that you might get very, very fucking cold. You might have to land slightly more traditional. So that's that peanut. What if we go to the left? Is there anything to the left? No. Okay. Okay. Past the peanut. Yeah, there's been a few occasions where there's like no power for, uh, a long time and not only does that mean like you know you got no hot water so washing is like out of the equation you've got to be stinky uh, so that goes that way onion ring cube okay maybe there's not more to see here after all okay yeah, and this takes you up to, to that, right? Uh, okay. Okay. No matter. No matter. We can, we can quickly 
zoom back on our two-wheeled device and before you know it we will be in greener pastures. Oh, this is so much better having this. Is this supposed to be food themed? Am I just hungry? I suppose it could be both, couldn't it? Uh, right, we don't need to go that way. And the orange, we did this, didn't we? Because this just leads to... Yeah, let's not, let's not do that. Let's try another door. Try another door. Let's try one we've not tried yet. I reckon that's where the, the enjoyment's going to be. Let's try... This one. Hey you. Stick man, come back here. Come back here. Wait, I know how this works. This is RPG Maker, isn't it? Uh, okay, he doesn't he doesn't want to talk to us, that's fine. I don't particularly want to talk to you either, mate. Pull the arrow. It's a big old hand, okay. I guess we need to use uh, something. That's, uh, not the right thing. Hmm. Okay. Okay. That's not the answer. I got a hot chocolate. How good's that? I don't know what that did. But. Fair enough. It caused it to flash. What's this? That's nothing. Okay. Uh... That face looks like it's straight out of Tiki, because there's a face very much like that in one of the little doodly areas. <laughs> Not happy. Not happy bunny at all. All these little doodles. I guess this is... Oh, look at this house. Don't mind if I do. Doodle. Okay, doodle. I can do that. Become a doodle. In some parts of the world, if you were to say that, you would be shot on sight. Becoming a doodle. Good, well, I'm glad we're a doodle. Is there any special powers bestowed to a doodle? Doesn't look like it. Oh, look at this guy. He's fucking having a little fucking party. Oh, look at that. It's a little family. Hmm. Musical? I don't have a, any... Oh. Okay. Um... Window. Diff-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-d-
It's a Czechoslovakian word, I'm sure. What's this? Open. Pon. Nop. This could just be garbage. Prasnzy Yikuli. Snow de Apewogen. I remember that from uh, World of Warcraft, yeah. Very, um, geometric. Diskmetga. Yes. This is what you've tuned into tonight. You've tuned into me reading out random gibberish that I read on paintings. Genio. Do you know what this is? This is like a Minecraft character that's been, you know, like lo fied, where they just do like the colours. Nah, nah, that's not what that is. That's silly. Well, it could be. I don't know. What's this? That's, I, who knows what that is? Whoa, you have quite a mouth on you, young man. What's this? Il Nabumek. Nice to meet you. Tebalin Axernip. I have this problem where uh, reading things on commentary, I, I tend to like kind of read what I interpret rather than or say what I interpret rather than what's actually there sometimes. I can't I catch myself doing that a lot. This makes this extremely difficult. Osibrachir Grotno. This one's really nice. I'd have that in my flat. This one looks angry. I wonder if we can make him less angry somehow. Look, what do you think about me as a fine piece of artwork? Oh, oh he doesn't like that, does he? Am I being too noisy? Hey. Okay, let's, let's get back to it. We've got arts to see. Was there an art down here? Yeah, but it doesn't look like we can get to that. Just a corner. What's this? The paddle. Troll Sulik. Yeah, troll is probably adequate. Oh, wow. You look spooked, mate. I'm not even going to read that out. I don't, I'm not even going to try. I just sound like a fucking idiot. Hey, what's going on here? Oh. He vanished. Where did he go? I can't use effects here either. Um, sorry. Feet or what? No, no. Yeah, they are effects. They are called effects. I was right. Oh, look. It's turned into like a little powdery crystal thing. Hmm. Hmm. All right. Do you know what? Let's um, let's cut this here and continue in the next episode. Um. So, so uh, episode two someday. Thanks for watching, everybody.